Hello and welcome to a quick review of a classic N64 import, Sin and Punishment, one of the best N64 imports of 2000, which is now available on your USB. Before we go any further, let me just point out the controls real quick. On. To move to move left and right, you gotta press um, Y and X on the GameCube controller. Now to yes, shoot, Y is to jump, A is to stretch your arm, um, cruiser from free land, from free range to other end. The left analog stick is to, um, Saki. A. Oh, Saki. Do it. But I've got a for the main story Good is, morning, Saki. You're a group of rebels. Good morning, Iron Trying to stop a corrupt government and a, um, evil race of species known as the Ruffians. At the same time. Come on, we got work to do. Shoot, shoot, and more shooting, and you'll save plenty of advantages. Right here, you shooting a crane that will fire that being fired by a couple of corrupt government officials. Take that ha <laughs> explosion. The action of trees right down. Uh, I may right where the control, but like once you get used to it, it becomes second hand. Like I said, there are plenty of action in this game. I clearly see. I just shoot down a couple of buses, now I shoot down an L ship. Now I shoot from the left, and now I shoot him from the left. And then I'm well sh shooter too, but like like I said before, Y to straight left, X to straight right if, if you're zombie. using the GameCube control. Now many of the bad many of the boss battles here are great, like this L thing right here that shoots you with a whole bunch of crap. It's pretty exciting to fight. Iron, cover our backs! You know, once you get that pattern down, they'll be easy to beat up. Really, oh. it'll be easy but challenging at the same time. It's with hunted, yes. And there we go, the airplane goes down for the count. Pew pew pew! Yeah, give me my point. <laughs> Explosions move the way. Get it on your American B system from the Virgin Council for 1200 points. 